Hey, before this video starts, I just want to say, if you like this content, make sure to like and subscribe to my channel. Also, if you want a video of your own, make sure to commission me either when I'm live on YouTube, or you can DM me through my public Discord server. Anyway, let me not take up your time. Enjoy the video. This wasn't supposed to be Maskey's job. And now I'm stuck with his leftovers. This happens every time. I swear that guy is so... lazy. Hey! You awake? Good. I've been over this way too many times, so I'm not even going to bother with you. I've already had a long enough day. <sighs> it's always the same with you humans. My name is Hoodie. I'm here to kill you. You didn't do anything. This isn't anything to do with me. It's more so to do with my boss. You see, my boss needs human souls to eat. And, well, he sent me and another person out to kill people. So we can collect the souls and the souls go to him. And he gets more stronger with each soul that he eats. Blah, blah, blah. I've already been over this thousands of times. I'm getting sick of it tonight. You're not the only one that would offer me money or anything like that to not kill you. Trust me. I've been doing this for lots of years. It's the same thing over and over again. I can give you money. I can give you fame, I can give you women, I can give you drugs, I can give you weaponry. I've heard it all, and then when I say no and I still have to kill them, they get angry with me. So let's not try to play that dumbass game, okay? I'm here for one thing and one thing only, and that is to kill you and take your soul to my boss. Nothing more, nothing less. Why do I do it? I don't really have a choice in the matter. A long time ago, I signed my soul over to this guy, and now he kinda owns me. So if I don't do his dirty work, I get killed or tossed away. Like nothing. Like a piece of trash. My friend was supposed to kill you tonight. But, he decided to be lazy and go home. Not sure where his home is. And honestly, I don't really care where his home is. <sighs> still just pisses me off to the point where I just get absurdly angry about this guy. Because I just said I don't really have a choice in the matter. Me and him have always been partners. I never liked the guy, but me and him has been forced into this field of work. No turning back now, I guess. Rehab? <laughs> Please. You think rehab's gonna fix any of this? What I look like? How I am? How I act? Don't make me laugh. 
the shit I've done already in the past few years that I've been working with this guy. They would have to lock me up on some sort of island or something. And keep me away from doing what I know how to do best. And all I know how to do is kill. That's all I know how to do now. So there's no chance of me actually rehabilitating myself. This is my life. And I'm sad about it, but I'm also glad about it. Because you see, with exchanging of working with this creature, the person I call my boss, in exchange for the souls that I get from humans, I get power. No, not that type of power. Like, powers. Like, oh my god. I'll just show you. You see... <sighs> Shit. Uh, it always hurts when I have to use these things. So you see... My boss gave me these powers. And... For exchange of souls, he gives me more of it. But this power that I have, I've been building up for years now. And I could say I'm very used to having it. But I'm not used to the pain that it gives me every time I use these goddamn tendrils. Stop begging for your life. It's not gonna help you. You're dying here, in these woods, whether you like it or not. <sighs> and there they go, running. They always run. Look, I told you. There's no way of escaping this. There's no way of escaping me, either. You can run all you want. I'm still gonna be one step ahead of you. <laughs> I don't have a gun on me. I don't even have a knife on me. No, 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 no. I don't even have any of that, you see. I was gonna just bring one of my pistols with me. It'll be an easy night, easy kill. Just one shot in the head and you'll be gone. And then your soul will be mine to take over to my boss. But no, I wanted to be a little creative with my kill tonight. You see this right here? Yeah, it's a pill bottle. I, I picked it up out of an abandoned pharmacy. I don't know what's inside of this thing. Well, let's see, what does it actually read here? Interesting. It seems like this is medication from a person who happened to be suffering from brain aneurysms. Uh, let's see, what are the side effects of taking the whole bottle? Let's see, side effects include foaming at the mouth, seizures, Ingesting the whole bottle would cause in death in a matter of an hour. 
fought on. <laughs> so here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna have you take every single pill in this pill bottle. And I'm going to watch you die slowly and painfully. Here. Take it. <clears throat> Take it. Take it. Don't you dare spit that out. Swallow. Good. Now you can go run now. You're deep in the woods. I don't think there's a street around here anytime soon. So, have fun running around in these woods while you die slowly. I'll watch you. 